today, I'm making small accessories with things I've collected. I made this patch by cross-stitching onto Ada cloth, cutting it out, and gluing it to purple felt. I'm not great at committing to patches, so I glue this to a pin back to make it removable. Instead of setting the patch on the pin like I was about to do, put the patch face down and set the pin on the back. Next, I have a bag of acorns that I acquired at an antique mall. I find one that I like and glue a pin back to it. While I'm at it, I take two more and make some acorn earrings to match. Next, I take a couple metal spikes and glue them directly onto earring posts. I found a bag of these little bears at a craft store, so I take a blue one and a purple one and glue them to earring posts. I also put glue on the other side of the post for extra security. Next, I have these bob -omps from Super Mario that I got in a micro blind bag. I have so many of these little figures and three bob -omps specifically, so now two of them get to live as earrings. Next, I have two little charms with the bee and clover on them. They open up too, very cute. I use jump rings and pliers to hook the charms to the earring hooks. I struggled a bit, but I got there. Next, I take these sun and moon beads and carefully glue earring posts to the back of them. These beads have the sun on one side and the moon on the other, so it's tricky to get the post to lay flat. Next, while I was out acquiring the earring posts and such, I found these charms and wanted to use the tooth and the bone to make earrings. I used the jump rings provided with the charms and hooked them to the earring posts I found at a thrift store. Next, I take this black chain that I got from the craft store and hook on white safety pins from the dollar store. I use a white safety pin to close it. Gay pin. Very gay. Very pin. Acorn collection. This gives me cottagecore vibes. Pin. Earrings. Spikes. Cute little spike studs. Simple. I like them. bob -omps. I like them a lot. If I can find more of these micro blind bags, I'll definitely buy more and make more characters. Mismatch collection. The bears are a little big, but I still like how they came out. They would fit well with the pastel goth aesthetic. These sun and moon earrings can be worn alongside a lot of different things. Great for a celestial look. These little charms are adorable. I think they would go well with a cottagecore look like the acorns. The bones are just nice bones. I wish I could have had matching teeth. Maybe next time. Necklace. Great to layer with other things. Let me know what accessory I made today is your favorite. Thank you for watching.